of a weight and this depth in this current, I need about a half an ounce. All right, guys, time for a talk. When I go out fishing, sometimes I'm fishing in areas that are uh, kind of restricted areas. And uh, in today's show, that's what I'll be doing, fishing in a restricted area. So I want to put a disclaimer before this show that if any of you guys go out and start fishing in restricted areas and get pulled over by the game warden or the state watercraft officer or the U.S. Coast Guard, do not say my name and tell them that I told you to start fishing in a restricted area because I didn't tell you to start fishing in a restricted area. But this is a restricted area. There are some areas that are restricted areas that you could actually fish in if you know what the rules are and you abide by them and then you don't get in people's way and cause a whole lot of problems. And there are some people out there that are always in the way causing problems so guys don't be that guy. But anyway, today I'm fishing in a restricted area. It is an area on one of the Great Lakes. And if you watch the show, you'll know which Great Lake I'm on. And in that area, we have a causeway. In that causeway, there are boats that pass through underneath of the, underneath of the bridge. And there's a lot of traffic in the area. But there's a lot of current in the area and fish congregate around that area. This area is a restricted area. It's, very, it's a very dangerous area because there's a lot of current coming, coming through that area. And that area, if you're not under power, you can easily get washed into the bank or into the, the sides of the bridge, crash capsize your boat and die, don't do that. It is a very, very dangerous area. A lot of causeway areas are just like this. They're very dangerous, but because you have that current, they act as funneling points. A lot of fish get pushed through those areas. And that's the area that I'm fishing in today. Now, when fishing in restricted areas, this one in particular, be very careful, read the signs. In this area, it is restricted, but the restriction is, is that boats cannot anchor in this area. So as long as you're not anchored, you're all right. And as long as you're not impeding traffic, other individuals going through the bridge and you're getting in their way, then there's no problems. But if you go outside of that, you're gonna run into problems. And of course, we all know the best fishing spots are always the hardest ones to get to and the most difficult ones to fish. So uh, that's, that's what I'm doing in today's show. Check it out. I catch some big ones and you're really, really going to like it. And yeah, if you get pulled over by the game warden, watercraft officer, U.S. Coast Guard, yeah, don't tell him you know me. All right. It's all on you. All right. Enjoy the show. Fish. Fish. Oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah. Come here. Come, oh gosh, he came off. Sometimes that happens. Man, that was a good fish. How did he come on button? The hook is good and sharp. I had it set, he just shook it loose. What happens is you get in circumstances like this and fish, fish, ooh, there we go. There we go. Down and dirty. Down and dirty. Down and dirty. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on in the boat. Ah. That's what I'm talking about right there. That is what I'm talking about. All right. That's what you come to look. Oh, that's what you come to Lake Erie for. Now. Huge heavy solid fish on a jig bite you gotta love it you gotta love it in the fall weather's beautiful let me get control of my boat here i want to get blown over the spot wow you have gotta love it you have gotta love it just lost one a little bit earlier i knew there was another one in there I love it. 
absolutely positively beyond a shadow of a doubt gotta love it all right put him back in thank you thank you thank you mr fish thank you very much courtesy jump thank you There we go. Oh, that is a dog. He's a good one. Oh my goodness gracious. All right, let me get a hold of my boat here. I'm gonna try not to lose this fish. Got to get a hold of my boat here. Wow. Boat control is everything at Lake Erie. Boat control is everything. Oh, there we go. All right. That is what I'm talking about right there. That is what I'm talking about. There's a reason why you're watching the Fishing with Joe show. Getting it done. In the background behind me, you can't see it. There's just tons of cars going by. They're all going to Cedar Point because they're having the big Halloween weekend festival. They're going by on the bridge. They're looking at me in the background. I'm jamming up. Yeah, I think they got the wrong idea going to uh, Halloween weekend. It's happening right here on Lake Erie. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All right, this one's going back so you can catch him. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mr. Fish. Thank you, thank you. That's what I'm talking about right there. Ha <laughs> ha! Need bait and tackle for your next fishing trip? Go to R&R, &R, the best in the Buckeye State.